the podium here. Uh, our pastor, Pastor Roger Dave, the music director of Adolu Baptist Church. He's got the rest of it Praise the living Jesus as we are proceeding in this in his presence. We shall rise up and uh, we're going to sing the song from our Baptist in in six. Praise to the Lord, the God Almighty, the King of creation. Oh my soul, praise him, for he is thy help and salvation. I just can't do it. Nigba si amko brori do gurwa. Omba project na toki. The scene is.
are missing in, in this present. Please join your hands together as we welcome Sister Adelika Grace. Sister Adelika Grace, you are welcome her. Please, you can do better. I know you are going to bless my administration. Please join your hands together as we
accounts of blessing. I take care of you. Media outsets.
the next theme is taken by the Quran, and uh, that's going to be Jesu Ishere, and the second one is My Hope is Built in Mountains. So when it's time, if I ask the congregation to stand up, please let their light for the Quran. We pick the same, the standards, and some other process. That's Jesus Share, one in whom you will use our AG, ETA, at the edge of 238. Be our Ebea Corinthian Corp. Alexis Ben. I want to smile.
this coming from from our practice in 283. Fortress.
Swallowed my microphone, but I didn't know you kept it there. Please let us appreciate them once again. Wow, I can see cool faces, it's good without wasting our time. In short, I desire to run this program under five minutes, and everybody will be going. Now. Is it possible? So I'll be calling like four at a time, and they will do four things at a time, and we'll finish. Why are you clapping for me? Okay. I will call my father in the Lord, Reverend Dr. Kendi Bamigade for theme prayer. Thank you, Daddy. Praise the Lord. Thank you for this opportunity. God bless us in Jesus' name. Amen. God bless us. Amen. Yes, we are going to pray, and I've been given a very limited time. I will make reference to some passages of the Bible, and we all go to pray. I will make reference to 1 Samuel chapter 16. If you will study verses 13 to 23, we see when David went to play to heal Saul. Particularly if you look at verses 13 and 14, then verse 23. I will make reference to Acts chapter 16, where we have uh, uh, Apostle Paul and Silas praying for their own deliverance and the deliverance of others. I will make reference to the book of First, Second Chronicles chapter 20, it's a popular passage. You know how Jehoshaphat and his people led the people to war, singing and praising God for their victory. And in the book of Micah, chapter 3, if you read from verses 1 to 8, particularly verse 8, Micah says something that he has been filled with the Spirit of the Lord to declare the counsel of God. What are we praying on? As ministers of God in music, we are praying on 
administration to fulfill purpose. To fulfill purpose. And I would like, I want to charge us, children of God who are singing gospel music in our time, please. The Lord is looking for singers, musicians, Christian musicians who will redeem the church. Many people are singing the name of the gospel, but you will know that it is one leg out, one leg in. But God is looking for people who will sing to heal the church of our time, to heal our generation. By the grace of God, I sing. But what, why are we singing? Look at David. David sang to heal Saul. Hello. When he was singing, when he was singing, Saul wanted to give him a wife. He didn't have money to pay that way. He was not looking for money, but he was fulfilling purpose. When you look at Apostle Paul, he was there to fulfill purpose. And the purpose then he sang to deliver himself and to deliver others. And that is the focus of our prayer, which I will charge all our musicians, Christian singers, to see it that way. That purpose is not to make fame. That purpose is not to make name. That purpose is not to gather wealth, but to heal, to deliver, to restore the church, to preach the truth. Of, am I here to preach? No. But we are going to pray. So as many of us as are singers, and even ministers of God, like you have Micah. Micah was not a singer. He was a prophet, a preacher. But he said, I can do this by the Spirit of God. I've been filled with the Spirit of God. If not him, David wouldn't have been able to sing to him. They were with verse 13. Verse 13, he was filled with the Spirit of God. In verse 14, the Spirit of the Lord left Saul. And that was why he was sought for. He came to sing. In verse 23, he was healed. As long as he sang, as long as he played the music, Saul was healed. Saul did not make noise. Eh? No. That there is noise doesn't mean that it is by the Spirit. Can I ask us to rise up to pray? Please, Lord, by you, I can sing to fulfill purpose. Fill me with that power of the resurrection. He says, if the spirit of him who raised Christ from the dead is in you, then you will do wonders. Lord, I lift my heart to you. Fill my heart to, so that you will be my focus in this ministry. This is not a career. Maybe you want to argue that as a gospel minister it is not a career it is ministry a ministry is different from career yes you can train you can have all those resources they are good but it is not a career lord i want to sing to fulfill purpose according to your will help me empower me let us pray that prayer in the name of jesus i don't know how many people maybe maybe singers don't pray i don't know but please pray that prayer if you are a pastor you are a minister of god in one way or the other Lord, it is only by you I can do it to fulfill purpose. It is only by your spirit. If not him, you are singing in faith. Verse chapter 127 of Psalm. You are singing in faith. You are ministering in faith. If not by him, if not for him, if it is not by him, you can't minister to fulfill the purpose of God. He sung to heal the nations of the world. He says, Go! Go into the world, into the nations, make disciples. That is the purpose of your singing ministry. It's a ministry, Lord, empower me with that power of the resurrection to walk in me. So I can sing to Him. I can sing to restore. I can sing for the salvation of souls. I can sing for deliverance. I can sing for restoration. I can sing to, to comfort people, to strengthen people in the Lord, to open the eyes of the blind. It may not be physical blindness, but spiritual blindness is the greatest blindness. So when you sing and they see 
then you are fulfill, you are fulfilling purpose. Lord, I want to sing to fulfill purpose. I want to do this ministry to fulfill purpose. Whatever thing you are doing in the church, whether you are an usher, whether you are a Sunday school teacher, whether you are a pastor or you are a singer or whatever, you are a minister of God. Lord, help me, empower me to fulfill purpose. To that Micah chapter 3 verse 8, the Lord fill me by your spirit, fill me again. Feel me to the brain. So I will not do it like others do it. <laughs> there are the others. There are the others. Everyone claims singing for God, but there are the others. I will not do it as others do it. That is what Micah is saying from, from verse 1. Other priests, other prophets were doing it to, to claim where to claim whatever thing. But he said, I am filled by the Spirit of the Lord to declare the counsel of the Lord to Israel. Fill me up, Lord. Fill me up. Fill me up, Lord. Fill me up. Jesus, renew this ministry you have given to us. Lord, give us a clearer vision of what exactly you want us to do from now. Father, let it be in the name of Jesus. Fill us with your fullness so we can see your mind, so we can say your mind, so we can sing your mind to heal our nation, to heal the church, to restore the church. Father, let it be in the name of Jesus. Father, by our ministries that you have given to us, we pray that nations shall come to your knowledge. In the name of Jesus. On the last day, Lord, there shall be standing fruits to show forth in your kingdom. And we will receive welcome, well done, faithful servant. Enter into the rest of your Father. Let it be our portion in the name of Jesus. Blessed be your holy name. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Please let us appreciate that. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Um, I will bring the next person to the microphone by going to the next program, which is in for Grace to the charm, Charming Son. This is the channel sound and a new back in the Lord. The first one is the channel sound shall be sung by the choral group. Why the any back in the Lord? We go on your audio to keep up or be any coffee back in the snow long body. How long to sit down in Bethany? Go down. It's a draw and you'll go just Good job. 
we sing the stanza of four together. Okura, please stand up. Okura group, choir, come on, church, begin. The very guest we've been waiting for. Okay, one of our guests. And um, I know we are ready to receive uh Pichati Shetola Tibomu. Atishetola Tijo. Atishetola Tiolo. And with that, with the due respect, I want everybody to stand up. What I bring to the microphone, Lady Evangelist. Thank you very much. If you're clapping your hands for the Lord, can you do it better? Come on, clap your hands for Jesus. We are here to hear the voice of the Lord and not the voice of any man. The Bible says that the voice of the Lord is upon many waters. The voice of the Lord is in the house already because the Bible says in the presence of God there is fullness of joy and wherever his presence is, his voice is there. How many of us are ready to hear the voice of the Lord tonight? Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Glory. We bring greetings from our mother in the Lord as a team from Trinity World Evangelical Ministry. God bless you. Evangelist So Shweto. She really loves to be here. But because of very good reason, not a bad one, very beautiful reason. And that is why she's unable to be around. But we believe that God is here. And we believe that He is here. The Bible says the Lord inhabits the praises of His people. Are you a people of the Lord? Are you a child of God? So God is here. So it's a real privilege and opportunity for us as a band here today to represent our mother in the Lord. And we pray that in the name of the Lord Jesus, whatever expectation that the world is waiting for over your life, today is that manifestation in Jesus' name. Oh, sincerely do you believe with us that God is manifesting you, manifesting his glory through your life today in the name of Jesus. Now can we celebrate the reason for the season? Come on, raise your hands and worship you. Let's see. 
Make sure you be in the clubhouse by now. But can you celebrate the name of Jesus? Because you are here as a blameless soul. Lord, you are so
saying you are not fit for the cross. He said you are calling this ukufu and shemise for you. The Bible says that why you were just sinners, Christ died for us. Not why you are now a saint. So wherever you are, don't condemn yourself. Name. 
by name, God will call you out of the centerpiece that God, the level has placed you in the corners of life. The Almighty God will call you by name out of that corner of life to the centerpiece of your glory by your stars in the mighty name of Jesus. Verse 5 says, Great is our God and great is His power. His understanding is infinite. Because the understanding of the Lord is infinite, the Almighty God will increase your own understanding in the mighty name of Jesus. Students, you won't be dollars. It's true in Jesus' name. You will be the head and not the tail. You will excel in your studies. And those of us who are working, you will be excellent in your various places of work and businesses in Jesus' name. Now we are going to verse 6. It says, The Lord lifted up the meek. Yes, you are the meek. You are lonely. But the Almighty God is lifting you up because He is the source of promotion. He is the God of promotion. He is going to lift you out of the dungeon of life. He cast them out the wicked. He cast them down to the ground. Yes, the Lord has lift up and debates. He will debate the wicked in your presence. Those who have said that they will be wicked to you, that you will continually be on the ground. The Almighty God will debate them. In their presence, you will be celebrated. In the mighty name of Jesus. I'm going to verse 8 now, where I will stop. Who covered the heavens with clouds? Who prepared rain for the heart? Why did he prepare rain for the heart? So that whatever you sow, you will definitely reap bountiful harvest. You will reap bountiful harvest in Jesus' name. And that means whatever you lay your hands on, you will prosper. Anywhere your foot tread, that food, wherever you go, definitely the Lord Almighty will acquire such places for you as an inheritance in the mighty name of Jesus. So shall it be for you. Said, who maketh grass grow upon the mountain? If it will be, it will be, it will be, if it will be, 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 so shall it be for you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Is not as we should just say the peace and the glory. This is heavy. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. And now, at the moment, a minimum one year of you.
Wow. Wow. And uh, this is that you are born on your prospect. As you know, your valley of my wife. If you don't know this one, I want to call that you are born. You need to know that you are born. Yes. It's truly a father. And mommy alone has always been there as well. Move it forward. Move it to the valley.
Bell. Tamalan, on Toby, Bell. Tamalan, on Wobby Dabba, Bell. It didn't be me, and it's your own party fear, your own young. He's also a graduated uh, pastor in this seminary. So he's a pastor to the core, and he's a music pastor as well. So he are under the umbrella of that ministry. So I want every uh, music pastor, I want to be me, I want to woo me, I want to tell me. Fuji, you know, I'm a little bit of a cocky, or I'm a little bit of a dad, my boss. My mom, my yoro, my friends, my everything. I appreciate you, sir. Pastor Isaac Oloche, I want you to carry on this church and I appreciate you so much for your support. But this year's uh, support is to pass it. All the ones I've been getting from him. I don't know what I'm saying. I appreciate I won't come. They are just three. I met a girl Any a poko, only a no no a po. I pay him praise. I love you this. I love you this. I love you this. Glory. I love you this. 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 Especially at the Baptist Church. I really appreciate you for your support every time. I appreciate you. And it's a privilege for me to be able to see you. I really share with you all the of Gideon boys. Not only the total, but you know, and the total train, but you know, my service, oh, I love you, to take a bath for me, and to feel for the share. You know, you know, it's more territory. You know, you share with you. Mon papa, on compte que mon fils est son confrère. C'est pas un cas, c'est un peu pas un homme qui a la fleur au milieu de camp. Mon père, par exemple, next year, on ne compte pas pour la valeur que tu as pour tous les deux last year. T'as des testimonies là pour nous. Next year, you have your own testimonies in the name of Jesus. On va se dire tout de suite, and that's top six. I appreciate you. Thank you, everyone. God bless you all. Till next year. You can come here on the top of the road. So next year, you have more testimonies than this year. In Jesus' name, I pray. The last name.